So first up, we are at one of our favourite places in Nottingham, one of the best coffee shops in Nottingham, one of the most aesthetically pleasing places in Nottingham. This is Effie. Look at all of this beauty. We have a beetroot latte, we've got an iced chocolate, does what it says on the tin, and we've also got latte, 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 the holy grail of coffee. They've got this party ring tiffin, which is from the pudding pantry, they use a lot of local suppliers, and this is a white chocolate, and I'm going to guess chocolate, brownie uh, from the Beast and Brownie Club. We're going in on potentially, I know that's a big talk, potentially my favourite thing to drink in the entirety of Nottingham, an Effie latte. I mean, you know we have this beautiful little relationship with you. Don't know much about coffee. That just tastes amazing. It is so good. It's also not too strong. It's the right side of gives you a bit of a buzz, but doesn't send you crashing into Subway. You may remember, folks, if you've seen the vegan episode, I don't really like beetroot. I don't really know much about beetroot. Don't know if it's fruit, don't know what it is. But how pretty is this? This is beetroot latte. Let's give it a taste. That's nice. It's really sweet. That's really, really sweet. That's actually a lot nicer than I was expecting it to be. We were speaking to Ellen earlier, actually. It's got a garby nectar in, which is what makes it, you know, not taste bitter like you're drinking vegetable. Um, it's very nice. And obviously, look how Instagrammable. We've got an iced chocolate. Fuck you, hot chocolate. We're going in on the iced. Oh man, that is good. That's basically a chocolate milkshake, but like really, really good chocolate milkshake. This is the party ring tiffin from Pudding Pantry. It is delicious. It's also going to be really difficult for me to cook with a fork. Let's see if I can do it. I'm not even being civil anymore. I'm just doing it. Look at this bad boy. Look at that. Well, that is definitely up there with the best brands I've ever had. I hope it's really clear we love this place. It's one of our favorite coffee shops in Nottingham. It's definitely one of our favorite new places in Nottingham. We haven't actually done a best burger in Nottingham episode yet. That will be coming. But for now, here's a pro little tip. This might be the best burger in Nottingham. Bonds, they've only been here a little under a year, and these guys, they've actually just got to the top of TripAdvisor for best burger in Nottingham, and for good reason. These burgers, they're next level. So here we have the blue. This is the plan, hints in the name, it's their vegan burger. It's got the impossible patty in it, which is the patty that's meant to taste like beef. But first up, these piggy smalls. See what they did there? This has pork pork. This has katsu curry on it, spring onions, and lots of other lovely little bits and bobs. But that, I mean, that just looks Fucking incredible folks. Just to top it all off, we got a freaky freaky deaky shake. Um, I can't even pick it up, it's actually that heavy. Greasy boy. Oh, it smells good. I mean that. Uh, that is quite an odd in a good way taste. That is, <laughs> that's a katsu chicken, but pork, not chicken. All mixed up in some kind of juicy sauce, gravy, almost gravy actually with the texture of it. And then you've just got their house fries, which can get separate. Their house fries are some of the best house fries you can get with their spicy seasoning. Burgers are what we're here for. This is the blue. This, this is something special. Look at that, holy burger. This is beef patty, blue cheese, bacon, onions. I think that's gherkin, looks like gherkin. And lots of all your slightly good bits. That's just a really, really good burger. It's juicy, it's got a lot of taste. The cheese adds, I don't even know how to describe it, just a beautiful little texture. <laughs> it's a tough. <laughs> I am a burger. I don't know why I'm an Italian burger. It's a really good burger. The bacon has got a really nice crunch to it. Already talked about this burger. Done an entire episode on vegan stuff. Should this be added to take two of that episode? Wow. This is the peanut butter and salted caramel freak shake. There's kind of a trend where freak shakes were everywhere a few years ago. They're not everywhere now, but they are at Bonds, not Bones. And it's bloody delicious. Good, isn't it? Yeah. Producer Rob doesn't like peanut butter, and he says it's good. If that is a verification, then what is, folks? What is? On top of the amazing food, it's just got everything you want from an awesome place to come and eat. They've got lovely stuff, they've got a wide range of drinks, they have live music every Friday. It's in perfect location in the centre of Hockley. And get this, folks, if you're a student, if you're lucky enough to still have a student card, then they have an awesome deal, like nearly as good as spoons. You get a burger, you get fries, and you get a drink all for a tenner. All you need to do is bring your student card or fake student card. And as long as you bring that, this, this, probably not this, but this, all for a tenner. Bangarooney. Next up, we've got somewhere slightly more on a happy tip compared to the last place. We are at Pokerways. It's Nottingham's first poker bowl place. What's a poker ball? I hear you ask that. It's not Pokemon. 
It's this. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a poke bowl, yeah, said like Pokemon, is a Hawaiian dish. Now, it's traditionally raw fish, mixed with a bunch of veg, got rice in it. It's basically the healthiest thing that I'm gonna consume in probably all of 2019. So we've gone for two. We've gone for the wasabi salmon, We've gone for the tofu one. Now we had to make the tofu one vegan because we want to showcase you guys a vegan dish. So what we did, the vegan one normally comes with kimchi in it. We took the kimchi out and we put some other stuff in there instead. So we've got the two here. Here's a fun game first, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get some titles on the screen. This is Sam tries to play, tries to play, tries to use, oh my God, oh my God, ah! Uh, tries to use chopsticks. So he can't even open them. So this is a really good start to proceedings, isn't it? Lean that one against there. Put it to there. Yeah. Put it over the top of that thing. Uh, like that. Okay. Push. Ah, I got it. Yeah, yeah. This is just some yuzu juice. They normally do it with cucumber, but my fussy side, I didn't want cucumber in it, so they kindly did me just the yuzu juice. So this one. This, oh, oh. Add wasabi sauce on it. So there's, there's a wasabi salmon. In it's in the name. Salmon. Lots of wasabi in it, which makes it spicy. But there's also fruit in there, so you get these really interesting mixture of flavors and textures. So, you know, if we get the melon, well then. <laughs> so, wasabi, we love our spice. Right, let's get some rice. because we So most of them come with rice at the bottom. You can choose between sushi rice and brown rice. We went for sushi rice on both of them. Sticky, sticky rice. So yeah, so you got your sushi rice, you got your salmon, you got a lot of wasabi. This is very, very spicy. It's a spicy boy. And then onto the vegan one. This has got tofu in. This is hopefully gonna be significantly less spicy than the one that's burnt my mouth off. And yeah, I've gone in for a fork because I can't use chopsticks. I'm not too proud to say that. Let's get a nice juicy, juicy bit of tofu in there. Let's get as much flavor in as we can. So I think, actually, I personally prefer the vegan one, the tofu. Tofu is actually really nice. Quite juicy, it's actually got quite a bit of flavor. And then all the different sauces and all of the veg. I'm getting like 10 of my five a day in this bad boy. Do you do? Do you do? I'm not going to front, guys. These are a good value. They're like seven or eight quid, right? I've been here quite a few times now. I haven't been able to eat all of it. In fact, most times I've had half of it and then took the other half home. Because they all, yeah, it's a lot of food. It's really good value. This is just the start of a few of the healthy places that we're going to be going to because we want to be filming the best healthy places in Nottingham over the next few months. So keep an eye out for that. We've had a lot of food today. I think we need a drink here, don't you? <laughs> Let's go. So we're at what we think might be our new favorite bar in Nottingham. This is Penny Lane, owned by the same guys that run Daskino, Hockley the Arts Club, and a few other awesome places in Notts. It's an arcade, it does food, but more importantly, it is banging drinks. So the best part, in our opinion, about this place is the cocktails. And you already need explaining why. Birds. Birds. So we've got the Calippo, we've got the Penny Lane Porn Star, and we have got the 99 Parfums. Better beaching one. Conchow, Limoncello, Orange Sherbet, and Limoncello. Limoncello? Limoncello? Lemon. It says lemon. Lemon. Limon. Limoncello. Okay. Calippo, Contra, Lemoncello, Sherbet, Lime, there's something else. Orange as well. It looks juicy. We are going in. Oh, that tastes just like Calippo. Penny Lane Porn Star. Base of vodka, but it's like a Porn Star So we're going to pop that in there. We're going to drink it. It's also got a little, little, little postcard. Love you, Mum. And I'm problems. But a BJ1. This is gin. Of course it's gin. Yummy mummies. Come and get your favorite little drink. It's just a bunch of juice and gin. By the way, did you know we really, really like gin? Because gin has lots of different types of gin. There is unicorn gin and then there's Who doesn't enjoy playing very, very aggressive uh, stick, ah, shit, ice hockey, one-handed, while drinking a cocktail. This is an extreme sport. Ah, oh! no, no, no. It's so pretty. Herbie, it's so nice to look at. It's so good for your Instagram. It's really hard to play this one-handed whilst talking. And oh, oh, calm down, producer Rob. And oh, oh, you want to fight? I'll give you a fight. And the cocktails are great. And oh, shit on it. And and the food, the food is really good. And one of my personal favourite things about it is on Monday to Friday. Get out of my way. On Monday, whoa! On Monday to Friday. Uh, between 12 and 2, I think it is, there's a meal deal where you get a sandwich, a side, like some really good chips, uh, and a drink for 
six pounds. Six pounds, six sterling. It might not mean much in the economy, but it's really good at Penny Lane. Producer Rob, come and give me a hug. Come on. Come on, suck your calippo. I'm really enjoying it tonight. It's been great. See you tomorrow. Oh, it's so cold. <laughs>